Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, joined here with the great, great D Shaky. Say hello, Shaky. Hello, everybody. Cool, so I guess I guess this is the this is the third episode, if I can speak my words correctly, which sometimes I usually can't. Uh so last time. Uh, you know, Japan, pretty historical. They like, you know what, we don't like the Chinese. We have a little kerfuffle. The Soviets are thinking, you know what, if they're having a little kerfuffle, we need a kerfuffle as well. And then the Soviets are like, oh, why did the Japanese call in the Italian boys? And we're like, I don't know. So that's where we're at. And uh, D. Shaky is currently trying to figure out a naval invasion of Japan, even though, well, I guess Japan beat him to a naval invasion first. Oh yes, yeah, that's been quite the problem, but it should be dealt with. They didn't get a port, so well, they're, they're just wasting divisions. Be, be here. careful, the Sakhalin Islands. Oh yeah, I have a guy coming up here to defend the crossing, so that should be good, hopefully. Muy bueno, and oh my gosh, I still only get point three five political power a day. Oh, why? Why do you hurt me so much? Close economy, propaganda results. Actually, can I, I like the seven percent, but hmm. global order. Hmm. Well, so much for I guess getting D shaky to send me volunteers, but that's okay. He's directly in the conflict too. Yeah, it's fine. I could just get military access from you and send volunteers nope. the old-fashioned way by just joining. <laughs> there we go. Or maybe not. No, 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 I, I accept it, I accept it. <laughs> yeah. I guess it, the game doesn't want me to send units into your tiles. Well, you have to accept it through Ongolia first, I think. Oh, yeah. Because they're not your puppet, they're just allied with you, I think. Mm. Oh, yeah, so maybe they would have to get it. Would you like a non-aggression pack, Mongolia? Thanks, Mongolia. I appreciate it, buddies. And, of course, uh, Spain is still in civil war. Good times. Yeah. Now that my <laughs> now that my volunteers are all gone, they, they don't stand a chance, really. You know what? With you in the war, they're really... Oh, they just lost another tile. Wait, why is it yellow? No, China, no. That is supposed to be my tile. Thank you very much. Oh, did they send divisions into your territory? I can't really see. They did, but they, they uh, claimed a tile. Uh, disgusting. Oi. Be disgusting. Oh, I actually have to pay attention to war score then. Since we don't play the peace conferences on. Oh yeah, so you can actually get stuff. And I can get war score too and give stuff to you also. That's true, yeah. That'd be nice. Can I beat a guy up here? Maybe? Maybe beat him up? No, no, no. You don't like beating people up? What's wrong with you? Uh, Tanu Tuba. What? Tanu what? Oh yeah, uh, Tanu Tuba. Still around. Wait, did, are they asking for a non-aggression pact? Uh, I think they did. Oh, wait. Someone has artillery? Wait, what? Oh, someone hey, has... just joined the co-prosperity sphere. Oh, so I am. Oh. Well, at least they can't touch us. That's, oh, well, yeah, they can't touch us. That's good. Yeah. I got like a Italy. thousand artillery pieces from, I think, you or something. Oh, some of these divisions have two artillery brigades on them. Oh, that's kind of nice. I wish I could send more over here, but uh, I just don't have enough supply to make 40 wits or anything. Do you ever use logistic companies? Yeah, I do. I just don't have enough support equipment to okay. use them right now. Just because I uh, love, love, love logistic companies so much. Yeah, I love them. I just wish that I had the support equipment. I'm slowly making it. I might be able to switch a few of my divisions over to it soon. Nice. South Kishore, well... Hmm. What do I get? What does I have enough? Should I go for infantry? More infantry attack and defense? Or should I go for something else? Attack and defense would probably be best. I, I unfortunately purged that guy, so I'm kind of forced <laughs> You're out telling me what to do, but you killed your own guy off. Hmm. Yeah. I want to go for that armor attack and defense. I think I had to choose between the two. Oh, and there's Siam into the war. It's heart attack piercing. Oh, it gets more self attack. Hey! Buddy, Mongolia, you going to give me 280 small arms every day? I appreciate it, Mongolia. Best buds. Oh, wait, hold on. China, not me, but China has a core on Mongolia. 
China, but not you. Huh. Yeah, but not me. Interesting. Maybe I it's feel just a little left out though. here. Yeah. I feel like if China has a core, you should have a core, too. We... What? You don't like you communists of Mongolia? If anything, it should be given to me. Oh, I see. Even you're moving through Mongolia. I have a little board with you. I can give it that. Whee! Yeah. Let's get rid of all this. I guess I can stop trying to steal tiles from you guys. So you guys That's alright. In the peace deal, it. it'll be fine. Aw, oh, yeah. I kind of want China itself to suffer. I hope there's more naval invasions just because... Well... Yeah, I, I just so they get weak. Yeah. And I, want them, I don't want them to get too strong because it might be a little difficult to take them out. But you never know. We can still infiltrate them later on. Yeah. Well, I get yeah, plus. Japan's actually being smart today, and they're putting their navy out. I might be able to invade soon. Nice. Possibly, yeah. Construction we'll speed minus five percent. Not bad. Yeah, I might do infiltration, just so I can like get stuff from this. Hmm. War of annihilation. Partial guerrilla operation. Credibility of doctrine. That's not bad. Exploit our enemy's mistake. Plus 25% division speed. Wow. Plus 25% reconnaissance and plus 50% attack? God dang. Huh. Or War of Attrition. Mass Assault Doctrine. I am going down the Mass Assault Doctrine to just see what that happens. See how that works. Oh yeah. Me too. Definitely. Oh, I guess... Oh yeah. There's that other um, land doctrine that you have in this mod. The Asymmetrical Warfare. Oh wait, what? Yeah, probably not too useful. Yeah. Yeah, like, oh, it's kind of a oh, weird one all the way to the I didn't right. know there was one. Yeah. Up. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's hidden back there. Oh, I haven't even done my land doctrine at all. Sweet. Asymmetric. That reminds me of Old World Blue so much. Holy cow. Yeah. Defense and attack on core territory. Uh. Wow. I'm glad you said that. I'm like, I, I feel, wow, this is cool. Is that a good one for you, or are you still going to go for Mass Assault? Uh, probably I so generally don't go Mass for Assault, probably. Well, strength in yeah. Militia, that just gives you more political power, it seems like. This doesn't give you, like, a... It gives you some buffs, but not, like, a whole lot. Yeah. Leg Organization, plus 10. Last Stand, Organization, more defense. Um, Entrenchment, plus 10, that's pretty good. Division Attack, that's not bad. And more Breakthrough... Hmm. I don't know. I'm only have I only have the first one done for uh, mass assault. Hmm. I don't think I need any more manpower. Oh man, that dip infantry recovery rate plus point three and better reinforce rate. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, Mr. Krabs. It's not bad. Deep battle wouldn't be bad either. Oh, Japan's back with the naval invasions. Uh oh. They're not gonna win. They're fighting against like twelve divisions here and seven here, so. I get stability? That's not bad to get. You know what? Dare to die core. Land out attack. Oh, I'll get more breakthrough, that's not bad. It's only twenty days, we'll do that. Cool. Oh I got more oh, what do we have here? Expand the Bremo Road. Improve the Bremo Road. War Bondrinos. That sounds like fun. But what else can I grab? You know, I'm going to get... Oh, what is that? Political mobilization. That's cool. Uh, we don't need to change that. Anything here that we really need to change? Not really. I'm going to go for more daily army XP. Eh, do I really need more daily army XP gain? Hmm. Entrenchment speed. And eh, it'll help with the uh, land auction. Once we have that. Nice. Wow. United Front plus 20% stability. Wow. Alright, so we took that. Yeah, with you in the war, it, they definitely thinned out their line more. Yeah, a little bit. I'm not able to do too much just because of officers purged. All my divisions are kind of bad right now, but... They, don't, at least need, they don't need leaders. Yeah. yeah. It's weird, though, because I remember when Joaquin the Tiger came out, that China would be crippled. 
because of their national spirits, and you'd have to have so much army XP to get rid of it. Um, but I do know Road to 56 is a little different. Yeah. They're a little more kind to China. China's a little more OP in this, in yeah. this mode. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah, I found some Italian boys, but they're not really attacking me yet. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I'm only at 1.8 thousand guns. That's all. Now, only if I could sneak onto the mainland. That would definitely thin out the li thin out the lines even a little more than it already is. <laughs> yeah, uh, that's true. That's see. okay. Oh, Sakhalin Islands looking not too bad. Go up to speed four, maybe. See what happens. They're attacking my lines a little bit, which is fine with me. Please, buff me. Buff me, guys. Even the Italians are looking a little questionable. Oh, yeah? They, they don't look... Mm. Oh, so, oh, well, at least one of these divisions doesn't look super strong. The other two look okay. They're between 1 to 11 infantry battalions in them. Hmm. Oh, they're attacking with tanks? Well, at least... Oh, we can pierce them? God dang, how weak is that tank? All I have is, like, 10 infantry battalions on most of my guys. You know what? Did that help out? Go and help them out, then. Oh, wow, look at that. You have 62% of the war score? Nice. Hell yeah. All that grinding in Minchuko, trying to encircle stuff. But don't worry, I'll, gi I'll give you everything that I can. Well, I guess... I guess we could just, like, add Japan as a puppet or something. Yeah, I, I could take, like, up. the proper mainland stuff, and then... you If you really want to, you could... If we have enough score, you could probably take Korea as a puppet. Yeah. Our own initiative. And eh, that's just cooperation. I have to think... I gotta think here. You know, I ended last episode thinking, United Front or our own initiative? If I go with the United Front, it gives China national spirit, and we get the event Communist Armory Incorporated. Oh, necessary. I don't know, man. I don't know. Front line behind enemy line. What is this? Eh, I think this war will end before we can really get down there. Lure them in. Looks really good. But, eh, those buffs are okay. Wait, enforce our goal. What is that? Focus on Dongbai Army. Focus on... Red. Oh, I can't do that one. A nice Italy got encircled in China. That's good. Nice. K typical... That could have been bad if they started opening a front there. Nice. Enforce our goal. Cool. I'm pro I don't want a protracted war, even though it looks really good for defense on quarter territory and max entrenchment plus ten. That's nice. A swift victory doctrine. Huh. So we get more attack on quarter territory plus twenty percent max planning. We also get war of annihilation. We need swift victory. I like war of annihilation because it gives you uh, increased credibility of doctrine, organization, and recovery rate, and division speed, reconnaissance, division attack. Nice. Good stuff. Bueno stuff. Yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, nice. Another encirclement. Uh, slowly, slowly getting this naval supremacy up. Maybe one day. Nice. Do you have any naval bombers? Sitting over here. It's... No, I don't think I started with any. I'm just making fighters, too, to keep up with mm. the Japanese Air Force. So. Makes sense. At a little deficit, but I'm coming back from that. Nice. Get logistics. Um, defense. We're going to need some offense here. Hmm. And some infantry experts. Nice. I got logistic companies, or supply wizard, logistics wizard. Infantry expert, good. Losses thus far. Well, I've lost 20,000 guys. Not bad. China's only lost 66,000. You've lost 40,000. Japan has lost 184,000. It's not enough. Fine for now. Soon it'll be much greater once I can actually pull off a big encirclement here in, in Chuka. If I ever can, I'm have to wait for this officer's purged thing. Do it. Get that big victory, that battle royale. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Uh, uh, you know, I will do this first. Let's build up the the one more military factory first, please. Thank you. Yeah, most of my guys, they're just dudes with guns. That's all I got. Me too. Um, I, have, I have tanks somewhere if I could ever find them. Probably out of. They're probably out of supply too. From that armored long trains. Before. That's the little thing I can do with my command power. Oh man, they're really trying to beat the snot out of my guys here. Oh my goodness. Well, Japan looking like the most 
Well, actually, the, the largest world tension has been generated by the Soviet Union. Yeah. You got some explaining to do, son. <laughs> yeah, that was quite the interesting decision on my part. Hopefully, I'll be able to deal with Germany, too. I kind of haven't thought too much about that. <laughs> Hopefully, this war ends. Otherwise, well, I, I actually have a lot of extra supply. I can make a decent army. Nice. Oh, no, they're actually winning a naval invasion. No, no, I got it. Not one step back. Good, we held the line. We have some armored cars, trains. I'm not sure where we found those, but I'll take them. And we're still mobilizing. I love it. Damage done to enemy, to enemy garrisons. Nice. Yeah, Mussolini. I mean, like, bruh. Come on, man. You want to join someone in a war halfway across the world? Like... Yeah. Oh, and it's and it's hard fighting the Italian Air Force too at the same time. Oh man! At least they can't bomb me in um, Western Russia. <laughs> yeah, at least so that's good. Not... Yeah. But you know yeah. what? It's weird. Spain is still holding on somehow. Oh yeah, that's that's good. I mean, they're probably gonna Maybe die. Maybe they'll make but... it to thirty. Yeah, they're not gonna make it to thirty-nine. But if they did, now, where am I getting naval invaded now? I keep hearing those sounds. Oh, you naval invaded yourself. Nice. You even got the port. Oh nice. wait, I did. Wow, I didn't even notice. Nice, exploited. Yeah, here we go. I had this th order set, but I was sure I would never get. Yeah, I have complete green, green naval nice. supremacy. Nice. That's great. Well, let's start sending some guys over there. Send all tanks to Tokyo. <laughs> yeah, I think my tanks are still slowly working their way over something. If they're even still anywhere. Sluggishly slow. Yeah, I, I want to see what happens. I, I really want to see the peace deal, because the game might just screw me over and give everything to China if it's a white yeah. peace. Which obviously wouldn't be very bueno, but if, if the shaky master, you know, sends a few volunteers, no worries, no problem. Yeah, exactly. Maybe even a, a entry into the common turn or something. We'll yeah, see. especially if I could kick down, you know? You never yeah. know. Man, I got 32 divisions. I am, I am getting huge, just massive. Oh yeah, Japanese tanks. I really want to see what the Japanese tank template is. It is one to nine infantry battalions, one to three tank battalions, and that's it. And maybe some engineers. Wow, kind of weak there. Go, shaky, go. Yeah, try to spread out as fast as possible. Have decent supply. Keep sending guys over. Only if this border with Manchuka wasn't so large. <laughs> Massive border. Third of Europe. Oh, Poland's going to create its own faction. They're going really? to create the Meet of Moors, yeah. On historical? What is this? I, I guess once Italy joined, it might have messed some things up. Yeah, it might have, yeah. Tear to die core, land right attack. Uh, that's really good. I do have some infiltration on our own initiative. Core attack is 5%. And I'll do our own initiative. Nice. Um, is there anything else we can do here? Not really. Cool. Initial attacking our lines a little bit. That's fine. Whatever. Whatever. As long as Master Shaky gets most of the wall school, that's all that matters. Let's see. 5 attack. Yeah, I don't want to attack in the mountains myself. That wouldn't be very good. I love it that they keep trying to naval invade me when I've invaded their mainland. <laughs> oh yeah, that does happen. They can like, do that. Yeah. yeah. Oh boy. Not putting their resources in the right place. Unfortunately, this officer's purge thing is kind of showing. Mm. I can't really beat their divisions in one-on-one -on -one combat. Oh man. So apparently, when Poland took that decision, they got rid of their guarantee by France. Hmm. Hmm. Oh no. Well then. You can invite Hungary to the Third Europe. Pressure Czechoslovakia. Hmm. Finnish guarantee. Guarantee that they're going to guarantee. Oh, huh. good luck, Poland. Y'all going to need as much help as you can possibly get. Woo. Order. Hey, Japan is 39% towards capitulation. Nice. See? <laughs> See if this can happen. Oh, you got this. 
Senor Shaky, the master. Uh, I might have to try to make a second invasion into Tokyo, just hey. because there's no way I'm going to break their line there. Ooh, Nagoya so. looking kind of... Oof. Hey, but you got Hiroshima, which is nice. Yeah. Let's see. I doubt I can find too much success here. But you never know. These Japanese sources don't feel pretty good, and the Italian boys, well, they're Italian boys. They might do okay. They might not. Alright, see, so give me that infantry expert. Man, back in my day when I played Hoi 4, you can make 44 combat with divisions because in field generals and field marshals, they had like minus 10% combat width. So, just 44 combat width divisions go down to 40 combat width. It would be so nice. Ah. Uh. Those must have been the good days. Man, those old days. Yeah. Old. I'm sure there's a mod that fixes things right back oh, up. They should oh. be. Oh, Japan just pulled all their divisions off their front line. Nice, and Italy's invading Qingdao. Qingdao. Wow. <laughs> oh, they no. invaded. Wait, they invited invaded each side of Qingdao. Oh. Uh, oh yeah, but they're not getting the port. Hmm. Yeah, nice. but they might encircle oh. Qingdao. Hmm. But it might be too late. And the other Italian guy is just kind of sitting there. Um, I like that China is moving its soldiers closer to the port, but what, what is China doing? China. Oh, someone visited me. I got support technology and field hospitals. Oh, a Canadian communist, Norman Bethune. <laughs> the Bethune. Canadian communists are fleeing to communist China now? Yes, they're defecting. Great. Uh, he visited Mao. He'll perform field surgeries for our soldiers to help her work against the Japanese. I love wow. the communist Canadians. Yeah, why, why aren't I getting communist Canadians? I'm the Soviet Union. Come on. <laughs> perfect. Glorious and perfect. All right. Well, I think I've done pr pretty darn well so far in this war. I haven't lost a single piece of territory. Um, yeah, I mean, this is going really well. Yeah, Japan's almost halfway capitulated. Yellow air over their mainland. Nice. And then it's going to be Battle Royale for China. Mmm, can't wait. Oh yeah, those are the fun times. Especially and then I guess I better start thinking about Germany soon. Oh. Uh, I think I'm just going to be in perpetual war against Italy. For Give now. them a little hard. Oh, I'm thinking about you, Germany. I'm thinking about you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I got 500 support equipment. Nice. Not going to use it, but uh, nice. Yeah, convenient. I got Oh, I mean, I want to use artillery on these guys so badly, but I don't have enough. Do I have enough? Oh, yeah, I guess we do. Cool, put them on. They're on those big boys. Strike them hard, strike them fast. Oh, we could probably smash these guys. Oh, maybe these guys, maybe not. Could you guys win? I mean, winning is nice, but... Oh, you... oh I didn't even... Oh, maybe you guys could win right there. Well, I'm more interested in this area. 77. 58. 59. So, oh, we might be able to win. You're doing a great job, Shaky. Just keep it up. The Japanese are like, yep. oh my god. <laughs> we'll keep running it around then. Trying. I only have like, I'm sending more divisions here, but right now I'm kind of starved on units to hold this line. There's another encirclement though. Should be good. Nice. Yeah, I just, I would, I would have never done that invading Japan that early. I, I'd be too scared of losing my navy. Oh my goodness. Yeah. I think I lost... Actually, I don't think I lost any ships. They were being kind of stupid there for a second. Wow, that's pulled their navy good. somewhere else. Wow. Yeah, now all of South Japan, I think, is unoccupied. Well, I don't think they have any divisions left down here, honestly. Yeah. It's nice. Wow. See, come on. We can take two more tiles. Oh, you kind of retired out of that battle. That's okay. Throw them back in. Mm, some Siamese Unless divisions. They have divi Unless they have divisions in Tokyo, this might be the end for Japan. I think their puppets will still live on since Italy's in the faction. Oh god, Italy, why? <laughs> oh! Oh, is that the end of the Civil the War? The first of one of the Spains. Oh yeah. I'd hate to be in that Civil War so much. Yeah, it's... I've never been able to play a Spain. I played as them like once. Ah! Nice! Very nice. 
89% towards capitulation, okay. It's our capital, oh, it's up there. Sapporo. Oh, I just boy. laughed that there's still naval invading me everywhere every other <laughs> second. Oh man, that's gonna be annoying. Even Italy tried another naval invasion, but that ain't gonna work so well. Did we actually capture this stuff? Yeah, we kind of did. Nice. Very good, guys. Very good. You guys are learning. Could we attack here? Probably. Maybe. Okay. Okay. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> uh, oh, oh, they even sent German volunteers, huh? I see how it is, Germany. I see how you do. Mm -mm. Oh, Italy getting the German volunteers. Uh, well, or they might be, or they just might just send both. Both countries. Germany, what are you up to? That's a thick Germany. Now they send them to Spain and Italy, huh? Not even Japan. Yeah, you'd, I don't. I don't know why. Maybe it's just because of they're closer. I, I don't know. I don't think the AA takes that into account. It's kind of weird. Secret programming telling them what <laughs> to do. Exactly. Come on, you guys got this. Come on. They're just they're just guys. 90. Don't send the horse boys. Don't send the Italians in, please. For the love of God, no, no, no. No, oh, don't cancel the... Let, oh, we, we got it. Nice. Oh, we were finding in mountains. Oh, God, that sounds terrible. Sounds like someone's invading me, but it's actually just northern China. Huh. Oh man, you're just making a straight line up from Sendai, huh? <laughs> yeah, it's they they have oh no, they actually are bringing in the reinforcements now. Oh boy. We were so close. They actually have some divisions here now. I guess they decided they should bring over more than four guys to defend hmm. Japan. Maybe maybe more than four, maybe, you know. Yeah, uh, we'll still get this though, hopefully. If I can strat redeploy this guy fast enough. We should be able to take this province and then immediately swing around and maybe take out them Italian boys. We might be fast enough to do that. And Italy has landed in Tianjin, which is a port. China, that is not a good thing. How have I not... Oh, I'm still waiting to get more fuel, huh? I don't think I use fuel, but, you know, maybe. All these boys in place. Uh, they would have capitulated, but they just took back a city. So close. That's okay. Yeah. Just clean we'll them up. Them You'll have this soon enough. Oh, man, that division's so weak from that Manchuko division. So weak. Oh, there they go. Japan stuff. Woo! Red Japan. Nice. Oh, another <laughs> capital's in Korea. Wow, that yeah, is... I guess we can go into there. That is oh, a little weird. they still have a bit of divisions, so... Hmm. Well. And their navy. That's why. Uh, only if Italy didn't join. Otherwise, we'd have a nice peace deal right now. So, yeah, that's weird. Like, I can't even peace them out now. But mm, I'm going to yeah. kill three Italian divisions to make up for it. Unintended side effects of Soviets joining against Japan. I guess I could try. Uh, th there's like no way I can get to Italy, I don't think. Maybe I can try something. <laughs> yeah, that's a little unusual, but that's okay. Ah, oh, cool. Go ahead. Yeah. Move in, boys. Move in. Yeah, since Italy joined, I think we don't get any sort of scripted peace conference, which is a little disappointing, but that's okay. Yeah. You'll just have to go through Germany. <laughs> mm -hmm. I'll try a naval invasion, maybe. We'll oh god, you go from, like, uh, Sevastopol and all the way to, like, Sicily? <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking. Maybe, I don't know, where where is all of Italy's divisions? I guess they probably have military access in Japan. 
Yeah. Oh, they're in the faction. Yeah, yeah, of course, yeah. <laughs> We're in the same faction, but I'm not giving you military access, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, Let me right. train some 40 wits. Maybe I can sneak into Italy while, while their divisions are hiding somewhere. Just okay. slither on in. Yeah. Division attack. Nice. Keep making some more factory. Just a little one factory. That's okay. Uh, I'm gonna spread my divisions out because the supply is just not bueno around here. Oh. Oh wait, that's the Empire of Manchuko now. Huh. Oh wow. Hmm. I didn't know they turned into an empire. I didn't know they're a puppet. Hmm. Yeah. Must have something to do with Japan capitulating, or maybe just road to fifty six. I don't know. Cancel one these with victory. You know what? I think self preservation. Hmm. Prepare for decisive battle. Nice. I'm gonna do infiltration. Maybe I can take some stuff from the nationalists. That sounds like fun. Oh, war bonds. Yeah, go and do war bonds, that's pretty important to get more factories immediately. Not bad. You guys are still moving around, that's good. I'm disappointed that they won't continue attacking me, but whatever. It is only August 1939. That's okay. Um, yeah, I'm dealing with so many Italian divisions in Manchuko that they all must be here or something. How many divisions so is this? Could be a good opportunity. How many divisions do they have? Let's see, probably around 35-ish. I guess I can send all my spies there now that 20, Japan is capitulated. 80, 57. Huh. Oh. I doubt they're garrisoning stuff. So, well, wait, hold on. Yeah, okay, so the Greater East Asian Co Prosperity Sphere is now green, which makes sense. But Romania yeah. joined the Polish faction. Oh my gosh, if you go to the faction map mode, there's so much green in Asia in the north part. <laughs> oh, yeah, the green Co Prosperity Sphere is a little cursed. And Perfect. It's just so weird that this is historical, though. This, I'm sure this is historical. Yeah, right? it has to be. Map. Weird with Poland doing their thing. Uh, the Poles got to do what the Poles got to do, but unfortunately, we probably have to pause this episode here and end it. So, and I started this, so I shall end it for us. So, thank you guys very much for watching. If you liked the video, consider leaving a like on my video, and as well, especially on D Shaky's video. Subscribe to either of us if you haven't already, because we both put out great Hoi 4 content. Well, at least D Shaky does. And like I said, I hope you <laughs> no, enjoyed you it. Did. And if you did, consider leaving. I hope you all have a great rest of your day, and see you in the next one.